Massive obstetric hemorrhage is a leading cause of maternal death worldwide. It is therefore critical that PPH is recognised and managed by a multi-professional team working together effectively. Prompt training provides a framework for management of PPH based on national guidance and evidence. We include algorithms that help to make management decisions straightforward for all members of the multi-professional team. Classroom teaching can provide a forum to discuss key learning points such as accurate measurements of blood loss, underestimation of which can lead to delays in administration of blood products, particularly in women of low BMI. Scenarios are used to reinforce these learning points in a clinical setting. The emergency is clearly stated and senior members of the multi-professional team are involved early on. Some nice deep study breaths for me. Well done, Cathy. Yeah. Hi, this is Cathy. She's a primate. She had a normal delivery about half an hour ago. Okay. Following that, we've had a placenta. She's had her PPH. She's okay. got an atonic uterus. Correct. Shall we get the PPH box, please? Okay. Cathy, hi, I'm Chris from the Obstetricians. Can I just have a feel of your tummy? Is that Maternal observations should be documented on a maternal early warning chart, which should help to alert the team members to the severity of the problem. An algorithm can be used to focus on stopping the bleeding and making a full assessment and plan. You put another line in and Lisa yep. put a drip up on this side. If I take some bloods for cross match. If you could take some in front, would that be absolutely perfect? If blood loss is significant and ongoing, Early transfer to theatre should be considered with a clearly vocalised plan for transfer. Closed loop communication should be used to delegate instructions to a named member of the team, ensuring that they acknowledge the request. Neil, I think if we go to theatre, if we can get some blood from Blood Bank. Yeah. Um, Sue, if you... It can be very useful for the team leader to stand back at the end of the bed, ensuring a helicopter view. The management should be clearly documented on a pro forma. Debriefing can be used to focus on certain elements of the drill, including clinical skills and communication. Fluid resuscitation and administration of blood products are key elements in the management of any major hemorrhage. As you've seen from this scenario, the key learning points include a team-based approach and appropriate treatment. If you'd like to learn more about how prompt training can improve care on your labour ward or to sign up for our courses, please visit www.promptmaternity.org or email us on info at promptmaternity.org.